Hello YouTube, this is Dazza the Cameraman. Today is Tuesday the 1st of April 2014 and today we are taking a look at this video 3000 mile wide disc caught by International Space Station. This video has been getting a lot of interest in the last few days and I've had a number of people ask me uh, what we're seeing in this image. Uh, it appears that the, this image of the Earth uh, may have been taken from the International Space Station and we see this large disk which uh, of course it has been claimed in the video is a 3000 mile wide disk. Now we also see this object here uh, which is a bit of a clue. It is not part of the International Space Station, it is actually something else. So let's see if we can find out what's going on here. A reverse image search confirms that this image was actually posted on the website of the Planetarium de Brasilia, uh, which is the uh, planetarium in, in Brazil. And uh, so uh, that made it easy to actually find out what was really going on simply by contacting the planetarium. As you can see, I found the Facebook page for the planetarium and I sent them a private message. Greetings, I've been asked to try to find out what the round object is in this image. Can you help me please? Thank you, David Gregg. And they promptly replied by saying, Dear Dave, the round object above the image of the Earth is a simulation of one explosion caused by a meteor. It is just a simulation created by computer. These sequences of images are parts of the movie Origins of Life, which have been projected in the dome of the Planetario de Brasilia. This movie tells a brief introduction of astronomy with the evolution of life in Earth and space exploration. Thank you. Now remember if we look at the original image we see this, um, this dark object, this silhouette here and um, some people think well it's probably part of the International Space Station uh, but it's not so let's have a look and see what that object is. This is the um, Facebook page for the planetarium uh, this page has been translated from Portuguese and you can see in the description here it says the Department of Science Technology and Innovation or SECD. Um, now let's have a look at their photos and uh, see what we can find. So if we scroll down through the photos we see this object here and here it is again here. Now this is the uh, device that actually projects the, uh, the imagery on the dome that we can see here. So this is the image that we're actually seeing silhouetted here in the image in the video. So uh, that's the explanation, it's quite simple. Um, Yes, the Earth imagery that we see here was taken from space, and I would say it probably wasn't taken from the International Space Station, uh, but from another satellite. Uh, the space station uh, orbits uh, fairly closely to the Earth at an altitude of approximately 400 kilometers, and looking at this image, I would say that it was taken further out. Um, but this image overall, with everything that we see in it, of course, was not taken from space. Um, because we've got this object here and um, so this this image was obviously taken from inside the planetarium where we see the silhouette of the uh, planetarium projector. Now I'll include links in the description area that will take you to the uh, images that I've posted on my Facebook page. If you're not a member of Facebook, not a problem, you can still see this post um, and the images uh, below. Um, you'll see the um, message that I sent to the planetarium, you'll see their reply and you'll see the original image as well as some other posts there as well. And as always do check out my Facebook discussion page Voices of Reason to Explain X or Vortex, you'll find a link in the description area. Thank you for watching.